In the remote village of Dandalapadia, in the eastern Indian state of Orissa, solar lanterns are transforming lives. The village has no electricity, and for centuries, life stopped after sunset. For women like Nagiri Dangili, who collects leaves to turn into plates, having a solar lantern has meant many more productive hours in their day. In one month, we're getting 300 rupees from salt plate stitching. That's more than the money we used to make. For all of the villagers, solar lanterns have improved their lives. It used to be that when night fell, villagers retreated to their houses to wait for the sun. But now, evenings are busy. We can work on our plate stitching, make traditional mattresses, and our kids can study. And when one is going out in the night, one can take the lantern to avoid the many snakes there are in this forest area. The villagers bring their lanterns to Pavati Badia, a local entrepreneur, who turned her grocery store into a solar charging station. She uses solar panels to charge the nearly 60 village lanterns. The lanterns and charging cost just over $1 a month. I'm getting much more respect now from the community due to the work I do. All the benefits are due to the light. Since 2008, 160,000 people have benefited from the Lighting a Billion Lives project. Funded in part by ADB, the project is run by Terry, the Indian Energy and Resources Institute, in partnership with local NGOs. We will be able to do South-South cooperation, knowledge transfer, technology transfer between countries in the region which actually are, which have a very poor statistics on energy access. This expansion project will benefit from the financial support and technical expertise of ADB in the field of clean energy. We are already working with many partners and we look forward to working with many other partners to provide these modern forms of uh, energy to the poor people in, in our region. The Energy for All project will soon provide more households with clean light sources, a considerable asset to improve living standards of poor communities throughout Asia.